Yes, thank you. The Minister for Defence, Willie O'Dea, has denied he offered to fight a man in a pub in Limerick following a row with campaigners over Shannon Airport. Mr O'Dea said he did not approach Geraldine Morrissey, a local activist, and her companions and verbally abused them. No stranger to controversy, Defence Minister Willie O'Dea was making headlines today for all the wrong reasons. The minister has denied allegations of verbal abuse during a night out at this Limerick pub last weekend. But one of the pro-Shannon supporters involved is adamant about what took place. He said, I'm the Minister for Defence, and the retort was, well, you're not defending the West of Ireland, people of the West of Ireland very well. To which uh, Willie O'Dea said, uh, who is this big P, and I'm not going to repeat it. And uh, he said, I, I'd love to hit you. And he said to me, into my face, I don't, I don't give an F about you. Minister O'D said he has a different recollection of the exchange. I work very hard for my people. I, 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 I don't get 19,000 votes by going into pubs abusing people. I don't think a politician should descend to that level, and I certainly didn't. I mean, if they are upset, so am I. I'm, I'm upset as well, but if there's anything, I have to apologise for the fact that I spoke to them at all, I suppose. So. The matter raised more than eyebrows in today's stall. Bare knuckle fighting in this country is outlawed. <laughs> well, we're not going to have a remake of Rocky Five here, right. Deputy no. Okay. So I'd like to know, under the uh, Code of Ethics for Ministers, if Minister O'Dea is going to come in here and answer the allegations made about him. But Taoiseach Bertie Ahern was quick to lend his support to his beleaguered Defence Minister. I know that Willie denies uh, any uh, abusive language, um, but I mean this is normal cut and trust. I mean what happens on the, the weekends in constituencies uh, is, is, isn't something I can't get myself into. In the absence of an apology, those involved say the matter is not yet resolved. My reaction now is I'm, I'm even more upset today because Willie O'Dea is now calling me a liar.